Well, my name is Khalid Mitchell, Deputy First Class here with the Sheriff's Office. Well, I joined the Harford County Sheriff's Office in 1999. Um, at that time, I was assigned to patrol, in which I, I did for two years. Uh, from there, I took an interest in school policing, in which I was uh, accepted. I was assigned to C. Milton Wright High School, and I've been there for 13 years. Um, I also took an interest in hostage negotiations, so I was a negotiator for the, with the Sheriff's Office for uh, 10 years. I was also a diversity instructor. Uh, well, the diversity instructor, uh, the, the job of the diversity instructor is to, uh, to educate the entire agency on uh, uh, basically, uh, I would say, uh, fairness in, in policing and making sure they understand different cultures of the community as well as race and religions and genders. Good question. I, it's very important to me to start with the kids. I think if we want to deter crime in this county or across the nation for that matter, we need to start with the kids. It's, it's very hard to change the behavior of an, an adult. Um, a lot of times adults end up getting rearrested for the same crimes. I always joke with my friends saying that it's, it's hard to change an adult. But I've found in the last uh, 10 plus years dealing with children, it's easy to change their behavior if, they, if they're guided the right way. So in schools, we're, we're helping parents and we're help, helping administrators uh, guide the kids the right way. So I think it's very important to start with the kids, Kyle. The most important part of my job or the satisfaction I get is that kid that returns to the school and says, thanks, Deputy Mitchell, I took your advice. Um, I stayed out of trouble. I got into something positive, and I'm glad you were there. So when the kids return to the school, you kind of get that reward that you might not get when you might arrest someone for doing something wrong, and you might not see that person. But with the kids, if you're doing your job correctly, they usually return from college and they say, I understand law enforcement. You know, uh, some of them have even gotten jobs in law enforcement and, and came and have returned to tell me so. So I get a lot of enjoyment out of that. I do not. Um, I do have a, uh, I'm the first law enforcement officer in my immediate family. I, I, uh, I joined the military when I uh, graduated from high school. And from there, I, um, I, I got an interest after I, you know, uh, left the military and law enforcement. Always wanted to be a teacher when I was in high school. So it's, it's no, you know, it's no mistake that I ended up being a school resource officer with the Sheriff's Office, but uh, well, I decided to be a police officer and I decided to put this uniform on because I wanted to give back. Growing up in high school, I was always one to respect authority. Not all of my friends did, but I was always one to. And I figured, you know, in between wanting to be a teacher and wanting to respect authority, um, I figured this was the route to go to be a sheriff. I think I could give back to my, the Harford County community, in which I grew up, grew up in. And uh, this, this is the greatest part of my job. Uh, I, have not, I, I have no regrets about becoming a Harford County Sheriff's Deputy. I've had nothing but positive experiences um, in, in my past 16 years. So it's like a joy to me to be a Sheriff's Deputy.